back to my channel. So today we are going to be doing an Ulta haul. I'm so excited for this. I was finally able to go in store shopping for the first time in like three months and they didn't really have a whole lot of new stuff out per se. Like only just like a little bit and it was like stuff that had already been released like a month and a half ago online. But that's okay, I did get some clearance things and then just like some restock on some drugstore stuff. But then I did place an order online of uh, some new things. So we have some new things, some old things, clearance things. It's going to be some fun things. <laughs> Anyways guys, before we get into the video, don't forget to hit that thumbs up button and subscribe down below if you've not done so already. And let's get into the video guys. So the whole starting of my Ulta haul started that I wanted to order this really cute, fun tie-dye little collection they have out. It's called the Don't Kill My Vibe 6-Piece Limited Edition Kit. It's by the Ulta Beauty brand. Comes in this really cute box with all these little eyes on them. And the bag is tie-dyed. So I saw this online, I was like, oh my gosh, I have to have that, you know, tie-dye. We're all about tie-dye nowadays. So here's what the bag looks like. And it comes with so much cute stuff. It comes with a little eyeshadow palette. And it comes with an orange scrunchie. And then it comes with a little jelly highlighter a lip gloss and a like heart stamp eyeliner so you can, like stamp it on your eyes so it comes with so much cute stuff and then for purchasing I think it's like you had to purchase $19.99 it's like 20 bucks worth of Ulta Beauty items and I think this was like right at 20 you got a free <laughs> a free Ulta bag and I saw this bag and I was like, oh my gosh, I need that bag. So I ordered, ordered this and I ordered this new Buxom Lip Gloss Scoop It set. And I think that was the only two things I ordered. Well, my first order, I did not get the bag. It came, no, no clear bag, no free gift in my box. I was so upset. So I emailed them and they were like, oh, we are unable to ship out just like gift items. So they end up giving me a $20 or $25 Ulta gift card. So I'm like, all right, let's try it again. So I purchased these two Ulta Beauty items. This is a really cute unicorn loofah and this Ulta Beauty uh, feeling peachy lip treatment kit so these two items I had enough in my cart in order to get it. I retried again to get the clear bag and finally with the second time I got the clear bag and I used the gift card that they gave me for my purchase so it was like kind of a win-win anyways you get this clear bag and then you get this really cute like other tote bag inside of it and then inside the tote bag, you get um, an Ulta Beauty like facial uh, makeup remover, towelettes, and you also get a watermelon juicy lip gloss that smells like legit straight up watermelon. And here's the makeup remover wipe. So. That's a really cool deal. If it's still going on, I doubt if it will be by the time I get this video up. Go check out the Ulta Beauty stuff. You get a big free like tote bag. Some good stuff. Alright, so on to uh, my in-store purchase. I got a couple things from the clearance section. Which was this, it's by the, you know the brushes by the Wet Wet brand? I love those kinds of brushes. I got this like purple one. It was regularly $15 and I got it for 7 bucks. So 
it's a flex and dry paddle so it's supposed to like help your hair if you're blow drying it and brushing it but honestly I'm just going to use it for a hairbrush. It just looked like a really cool item. And then I got this Ulta Beauty Cream Blush in the shade Sunrise. It was it was normally 10. I got it for a 4.97. So, here's what it looks like. excited for that and then I am always I always go back to the back to check out like their hair stuff because they have some really cool like clips and pins and all this kind of stuff you can put in your hair and they also have some brands with some really cute scrunchies so I got this one by the brand scrunchie this like wild one and then this is also by this brand scrunchie and it is like a purpley a purpley color so I got these two and then I also got a new one from the brand Invisibobble Invisibobble is now making scrunchies that have the actual Invisibobble clear hair tie inside of them so I got a leopard print and they have their little Invisibobble logo there so I am really excited about this one and then I needed a new uh, powder. I use this powder like at work because my makeup always kind of breaks up on me at work and I always keep it in my pocket at work. And I always keep one on hand in my purse. It's the Maybelline Superstay Full Coverage Powder Foundation. That's what it looks like. And then I also got the e.l.f. Camo Concealer in the shade... Uh, fair beige and this is the hydrate one I have went through multiples of these and I needed a new one so those are just a couple of restock items and then I got a few items from the this is like I guess a new line to LA girl I guess maybe not maybe it was just like a new like summer display because I know I know she's had these like super shock <coughs> um these super shock eyeliners I've seen them before but I never picked anyone up and I've seen people use this yellow one a lot so I picked up the yellow one and a pink one and then also on the display they had these LA girl glitter glitterholic glitter toppers so I got these two, this one, this one is like a pink shade, and then this one is like a clear silver iridescent shade. So I got these four things from LA Girl. <clears throat> and then I got a couple things from, well one thing from BH Cosmetics is the new blushing in Bally palette. I think this was new for summertime, but it was, I think it's been released for a little bit online. So here's what the palette looks like. And then inside you've got three blushes up here. And then down here, you've got like three highlighters. This one is like way too dark for me. I wouldn't, won't be able to use that, but I'll probably be able to use these two. And I love the blush, the blushes. <laughs> I love the blushes. I think they're really pretty. And then the last thing from my in-store shopping trip is this I Heart Revolution. This is the So Hot, I guess? No, Tasty Chili Shadow Palette. So I Heart Revolution has like all these fun eyeshadow palettes that all have this like fun design on the front. They'll, I know they have like a coffee one, one with dogs. Um, I don't know, they have like all kinds of food palettes and I decided to get this one because it reminds me a lot of like summer and fall because it has this like really pretty hot pink purpley shade and then some other nice pink shades and then it moves into like a whole lot more warmer shades over here for fall and I know we'll all be thinking about fall around here before we know it 
<coughs> so I went ahead and picked this one up. I wanted to try out one of these from that line, and if I like it, I might end up getting a couple more, but that is everything from in-store, and then I have my box from when I placed my Ulta order to get the clear bag. I got a few other things I forgot to show you guys. So, the first thing I'm super excited about is this palette, and it's kind of creepy because she blinks, like... Hello! <laughs> Anyways, it's a little creepy, but it's really cool. It's got that, like, 3D effect, but it's from Essence. It's called the Witch Side Palette. <coughs> Excuse me. When you open it up, here's what the shades look like, and they are just stunning. This palette was super affordable. I have the only thing I've tried out from the brand Essence is their mascara. And here's what the palette looks like close up. If you all are a neutrals fan and you love neutral shades, I would recommend this palette. I swatched all of these like marbly shades right when I got the palette and they are just stunning. They swatched amazingly. And I'm going to go ahead and swatch some of the shades for you guys. Just kind of want to, I want to show you how beautiful these shades really are. So here are like the marbly shades. And then I'm going to do two. So here are like the marbly shades, they're super iridescent, and then here are the mattes, they swatch so good. So I'm so excited about this palette. And then the last palette I got, also super affordable, super cheap, I love like drugstore brands so much, is the BH Cosmetics Weekend Vibes Mimosa palette. Here's what it looks like. This is actually new. I just saw it online. Here's what the shades look like. It's a classic like pink palette. As you all know, pink shades are like my favorite eyeshadow shades. And they're just so, they're so pretty. I love all these pink shades. Here's just like a close up of the palette. I love how like iridescent the like the cardboard is around it. And then it does come with a nice mirror. And then here's what the front looks like close up. And then the last few things I got from my online purchase is these new lifter glosses from Maybelline. And I've seen people already um, saying that these are a dupe for the Fenty Gloss Bomb glosses. Here's what they look like. They are really pretty and I will show you guys since I have you zoomed in. They do have the really big doe fit wand, just like the Fenty Beauty glosses. But I have to say, I love the scent of these ones. I like the scent of these ones way better than the Fenty Beauty gloss bombs. The Fenty Beauty gloss bombs kind of, it's like a fruity scent, but it's kind of like a bad fruity scent. Like I can wear it and the scent kind of dissipates and you don't really realize the scent is there, you know. But I'm really excited to try out these Maybelline ones. And that is going to be my Ulta haul. I haven't gotten to film an Ulta haul for you guys in a really long time. So I was excited to sit down and show you guys everything I've gotten. <sighs> I'm out of breath and I don't know why. <laughs> I need a drink. But you all, thank you so much for watching today's video, and don't forget that you are absolutely stunning. Bye guys, thanks for watching. So check out my Instagram pages at Colorful Gidget or my new brand at Spunky Scrunchies. And don't forget, if you haven't subscribed, click the circular icon in the middle. Or if you haven't seen my most recent or another favorite of mine, click the one on the top right or the bottom right.